Little Beans, I am so excited to announce our latest giveaway. We are going to be giving away a Nintendo Switch Lite to one of you very special Little Beans in the community. If you want to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is leave a like on the video, subscribe to this channel, and then click on the link in the description to fill out the application form. The winner of the giveaway will be announced on the 1st of March, and the selected winner will be able to choose the colour of Nintendo Switch they want and have it shipped directly to them. If you want to enter the giveaway, you do have to live in the US or the UK, and there are a few terms and conditions which are all linked in the description as well. Good luck, little beans! My name is me and welcome back to another video. Before we get started with today's video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell so you never miss any of my daily Raw High videos. I am joined by Callan and James. Hi guys. Wait, James. Hello. What the heck are you wearing right now? Why have you got abs? Because that's the new top. Okay, we'll look at all that in a minute, but you guys, I want to talk to you today about one of the most exciting new additions in Royal High, something the community has been asking for for ages, something that Callan got the opportunity to work on and has been so excited about, haven't you, Callan? And that is right here. Yeah. If we go into the hairstyles, right? Mm hmm I'm only going to wear it for the purpose of showing you guys, not because I wear one mm -hmm. myself, but... Mm -hmm. Right here, by Ready the Teddy, and of course, Callum worked on it too, we have a hijab, you guys. Added into the game so that you can now actually wear the hijab in-game. So I'm going to put it on and take off Dolly and my and my halo, just so that you guys can probably see it, because I want you to be able to fully enjoy it. Again, I'm only wearing this for the purpose of displaying it, but um, I want you guys to be able to fully see it. So let me take off the um, thingy there, and here it is. So here is the hijab added into the game, you guys. So Callum, you wanted to talk a little bit about it, right? Okay, so one thing that I that was hard about adding the hijab to the game was we wanted to add it, but we wanted people to be able to recolor it, and we wanted it so that people couldn't put hairs underneath it or disrespect it in any way. Mm -hmm. So it took me three hours to get it, all the stuff done for it, mm -hmm. but we were finally able to get it to the point where um, it is unremovable unless you replace your hair. So if you look like when you recolor it, if you try to like continue without coloring it, it defaults it to black. If you try to like, there's no more like remove button for the accessory. If you have it, if you have the hijab, Let me show. Um, like you uh, can look in your inventory, it doesn't have a remove. Ah, yeah. So you can't take the actual accessory off to separate it from uh -huh. the hair underneath. Right. And then you see like next to done coloring, it usually has like a remove button there. Yeah. That's not there anymore. So I had a, you've really thought about this. I tried every single way to get it off me, and I was I was unable to get it off me without changing my hair. Okay, so you have done a very good job of making sure that it's very culturally respectful, which is mm -hmm. really good to see. So as you guys can see, the hijab looks amazing. I'm so glad to see that it's already in. This is a huge first step for Royal High with having cultural clothing included in the game. It means that you guys will be able to obviously represent yourself. If you are a person who wears a hijab, you will now be able to wear one in game. And I'm sure it does open doors to many, many, many more cultural clothing items that are going to come to Royal High in the future. And this makes me incredibly proud. And Callan and Ready the Teddy, I'm so proud of you guys. This is amazing. And I'm so glad to see it in the game. And I'm so glad you took so much time and effort to make sure that it was culturally accurate you couldn't take it off you couldn't put hair underneath and things like that to make sure that it was properly done it means it, it will mean a lot i imagine to the muslim community in particular that you've spent so much time putting in all that energy and effort to make sure it's right it's correct so yeah thank you to the devs i love that and i'm so proud of you and you guys can now wear it in game so yeah it's there it's available now and all you have to do is head over to the hairstyle section to add the hijab if you want to wear it so very nice i'm very proud of you guys so thank you for sharing that with us Callum. of course all right guys so hopefully there's going to be even more where that came from in terms of cultural clothing but thank you for watching this little video i wanted to make it into a little video so that you guys could get a proper insight into this especially if you missed it on my stream i'm so proud of the devs i'm so excited and thank you for sharing it Callan. of course i'll see you guys next time goodbye